that person right there. I'm glad I didn't hit that cat, that was close. I'm glad I wasn't going faster. Um, okay, what else? So, yeah, better skills is important, right? I don't even do my practicing right now. My car been practicing. Oh, I forgot I'm recording sound on the GoPro now. And I don't even know if you can hear my voice. Because if I could hear the wind in my ears, if I could hear that wind sound, I know the GoPro is picking up wind sound. I'm not going very fast. I, was doing, I think I'm going 14 miles an hour right now. And that may allow you to hear my voice clearly because the speed's low. I won't know till later though. But I guess if I'm going to keep using the GoPro, I really should get one that can cancel out that sound, the wind noise. Or just use the Insta360 only. Just use that. I don't know. I'll think about it. Oops, the car's coming. So I see the sky getting a little brighter. And I did bring sunglasses because there was a day that I rode when the sun was coming up and I think the round trip is uh, 54 miles round trip on this bike path. The whole, if I use the whole bike path. Oh, I think I might as well go to the slide here. I should probably come back with a shovel and widen that part of the path. Because anyone on the left of the is going to be at great risk right there of pedal flipping the side of that mountain. And that's on the Fullerton loop. It 
is amazing to see the body learn to balance just watching that process the body is just so amazing that was always emphasized to me growing up I would talk about that a lot with people like just how incredible the body is it heals itself it learns it does things without even thinking about it and I would call learning to ride an electric unicycle I would call this is where I almost yeah you can't see far down the street that's what happened this is where a car was coming and I stopped right here and they stopped too um, an electric unicycle I would say also is in, the, in that area of it's not thinking about it it's doing it's an intuitive thing to me I guess it could be thought of but how do you think about balancing I don't think about balancing I just balance maybe it can be thought of but for me it was just doing it and feeling that sensation of balance that's what it was for me so I've done a lot of practice in the past with like higher speeds and just getting familiar with I'll call it the sensation of being at a high speed and what it feels like what the unicycle feels like that way I can keep up with people at those speeds if we go on rides together which there's large group rides uh, that go often but carving is something I want to spend more time so carving riding backwards sharp turns uh, turning at high speed these are things I want to practice when I say carving I just mean this I mean going back and forth going back and forth smoothly right? so there was an electric unicycle in a race it looked like a lynx I don't know if it was though but this thing was shaking like crazy when this guy was racing I mentioned this really earlier I don't think I mentioned what model I thought it was and I thought it was a lynx but I don't know for sure and when the guy would slow down in the corner like slowing down it would bobble really bad and then accelerating it would it looked like it was smoothing out under acceleration but under deceleration coming into the corner slowing down and turning it was wobbling and the person never crashed it in that race but i just thought to myself that that doesn't look uh what word would i use for that it does not look in uh, confidence building if i say it that way it does not look like confidence building right a confidence building experience okay so here i'm, I'm gonna break out so bad <laughs> i'm gonna have another cliff bar and have some more water thirsty right now there's a motorcycle
cars really come down this road fast, huh? It's a fast downhill. Yeah, I think we're ready for our journey again. That's weird, it still says 100% capacity. Voltage 139. I don't know, it doesn't make sense. Here we use two bars out of eight to go 30 miles, and that's because I went slow. I was going slow here, that's why. this bike path sign right here so you see the sign and then look how hidden this I'm gonna call it hidden because like to me it seems a little bit hidden I mean there's just not a big sign showing you where the bike path is that's a no parking sign let's see if there's an actual sign for this path 